limited and environment. Let's learn together. What is habitat? A habitat is a, the place where living thing lives. Habitat provide living things with everything that they need to stay alive. A habitat provides a living thing with air, water, food, space, and shelter. What is population? A living thing seldom lives on its own. It usually live among others of its own kind. A population is group of living things of the same kind that live and reproduce in the same place. Populations of animals and plants in different habitats what are some habitats in environment and living things found in them we can usually find populations of several kinds of animals and plants in a habitat the garden forest desert and sea are some example of a habitat garden. Here are some animals and plants found in the garden. Bee, butterfly, spider, ants, bulbul, snail, hibiscus, bougainvillea, tree. Forests. There are many types of forests. A tropical forest is an example of a type of forest. Here are some animals and plants found in the, for in the forest. Snake, slot, eagle, monkey, jaguar, Fern, vine. Jaguar are hunted and killed for their fur. We can help stop killing if we stop buying and selling products made from jaguar fur. Let's care our earth together. Desert. Here are some animals and plants found in the desert. Cactus, snake, elf owl, spider, jackrabbit, creosote bush, road runner, iguana, and also fox. See, here are some animals and plants found in the sea. Dolphins, sea turtle, lionfish, clownfish, seagrass, coral moose, and also sea anemone. Animals such as turtles and dolphins can choke on plastic bag or styrofoam cups that are thrown into the sea. We can prevent this by throwing our litter into dustbins instead of the sea. Let's scare our earth together. Salty 
and unhealthy environments. How can we tell if an environment is healthy? We can tell if an environment is healthy by observing its conditions. Healthy environments. Healthy environments are clean, have plenty of fresh air, and fit for people, animals, and plants to live in. A clean garden, a clean river, and also a clean housing area. Healthy environments. People, animals, and plants can be harmed if they live in an unhealthy environment. Look at an unclean housing area. The unclean housing area is a place where germs grow well. Germs can cause many diseases to spread. An unclear river. The unclean river can cause us to vomit and fall sick. Industrial area. The industrial area has a lot of smoke. Smoke can make our eyes itch and affect our breathing. Caring for the environment. How can we care for the environment? Dispose of rubbish properly. We should not dump rubbish on the ground or into drains, river, and seas. We should dispose of rubbish properly into rubbish bins. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. We should reduce the use of objects made from metals, plastics, and paper. We should reuse and collect them so that they can be recycled into the new object. Stop burning! We should not burn wood and rubbish. Burning produces a lot of smoke. So, that's all the lesson of today. Thank you. Bye.